So then, just two days after a gut-wrenching defeat in the last minute against Tottenham, we're back at the CBS for a league game. Surprisingly, a 3pm kickoff today. But don't get too excited, it is Swansea, a team we've not beaten since 1981 at home. We've come very close over the past two seasons. Last year, they scored a free kick in the last minute. The season before, we bottled a 3-0 lead to draw 3 all. I am quite confident today. We play really well against Tottenham. That's a very good performance. If we could put that into today's performance, there should be no reason and why we don't go away with three points. So then, a Saturday 3pm kickoff for the first time this season. Quite a strong side starting as well. Very similar to the one that played against Tottenham on Wednesday night. Bit Wilson in there, Bessetson in there. Oliver Dobbin comes in for Ben Wilson, who I thought had a really good game against Spurs, but Dobbin still the league number one by the looks of things. Here you go then. kick to Swansea. We all know what happened last time. They had a free kick. Once again, it's going to their players. Get it out. Alan's hit our forward. The Sante now on the attack. Whoa. Quick response. Hit it. Oh. Oh. Good save from Bigaro. We're trying to, you know, give a response here. Going 1 0 down early. What are we doing? A complete contrast to what we saw on Wednesday night. We've been awful. 15 minutes in. I've never seen two players over for a corner before. <laughs> and Britain not even touch anyone who's brilliant. Oh, it's too easy. Things clears it. It goes. Oh, come on now. <laughs> Alan gives the ball away. Letting them have the ball. Just letting them have the ball. This is terrible. I don't blame these lot for going. This has been the worst half an hour of football I've watched in a very long time. I don't even want to sit in and pinpoint individuals because no one's been any good. We've been letting them have the ball. This is awful. Very, very bad. Brilliant save. And there you go then, half time. Straight down that two. Well, you know what I could do after that poor first half? 
I know it's round to kick it for a ticket, but we're definitely not going to get that. We've just got these lot warming up. First half an hour, we thought we were asleep. A complete contrast of what we saw on Wednesday night, considering it was pretty much the same team by the goalkeeper. Rodoni gets the goal back, the set hits the bar just narrowly, leaving us training at half time. And there we go then, second half. Bidwell on the left. Another cross. Oh, just too much that time. Come on, Rodoni with the ball. Crossed in. Way too much. Bit of work in with a ball, that was a nice ball, oh! Come on, my lad. Nice, good ball in, safe on the keeper, corner. And finally, this place is bouncing. We've still got over an hour. The rain delay has cost us all the momentum we had. Swansea now, you know, knocking the ball about, winning every second ball. We're clearing our lines though, and then passing it back. Let's go, quicker, quicker. Let's go, Mason Clark. There's so many black shirts compared to blue shirts. What is he doing? Just over five left of more and more time. I tell you what, our momentum has derailed since that rain delay. Swansea have the majority of possession. Just knocking it about, just time wasting, taking about two minutes to take a throw in. Come on, Sakamoto. Oh, lovely. Good ball. Mason Clark. Ellie Sims. Hit it. Hit it. What is going on? Well, how have we not scored there? We're now following up with one of these throw-ins of Orlando's that have never, ever worked. That one's been cleared. Look at this. The quicker in a mobility scooter, mate. Oh. So we've just reached the 98th minute and the amount of time wasting Swansea have done, it should be going on for at least two more. Just, just go. There you go. Full time. Another defeat. Just don't think we've ever well beat Swansea, will we? Very poor start to this game. Like I said, we had so many spells where we not like we were going to score, but on the counter, we're just way too slow coming forward. A lot of negativity today. From these fans, when we went 2-0 down especially. I mean look at the state of the CBS now, the majority of the fans were what trying to leave two, three minutes ago. 